Hey everybody, Super Sport Rider here, Brooklyn, New York. This is one of my latest things I came up with. It's a regular stick plane. The uh, foam board made plane, 30 inch wingspan, real easy. Almond wing design, kind of like that fold over shit. My fuselage over here is beams instead of a box. Very easy just to plate things together. This thing is very stiff. There's no flex on it, it's super light. I think this whole plane weighs about 450 grams. 500 grams my motor from a FPV Raptor's original motor. It's got 28 millimeter, probably about by 22. It's not so deep. It does a good job in this little plane though. So enough of the talk. We're gonna bind it up, pick it up, and well, it does fly well. Just got about 10 flights on it. Land's pretty sweet, I didn't even nick it yet. That tail is from a dogfighter. It's the only part of the plane I didn't make. This thing's real easy to make. Good flyer. You don't even need plans for it. Just look at it, make it. Glue the friggin' wings over there. Channel a little slot in here. So there's something for the wings to go into. Uh, uh, take off the wrong way after that lady. A little snow there, why not pick it up right here in the middle of the field? Kind of dried up. I didn't expect it to be this dry. I expected it to be mud like that everywhere, but it's not. Pretty cool. So the wind's coming out my face from this way. Basically, got a pretty flat runway here. I haven't flown this plane in a couple of weeks, it's been shitty out, so. Get up, right up, left up. We got our rudder still functional. So let's just pick up this bad boy. But my hat cam is good for you guys, so using a hat cam. But I figured if, if, if it could pick up the FPV Raptor <coughs> with that incident, it'd pick up this little plane like a mother. It kind of does. It'll still stall though. I got birds already. You believe this luck? I love it. I think they came up when they saw the plane, maybe, already. Happens all the time here. I chase them around, I go through them. Like I just did, it's so awesome. He's climbing. He's into the wind. A lot of my plays like is when they go into the wind, they'll climb a little bit. I know, uh, aeronautics engineer, really. Uh, this is my first flight in a few weeks, really. I've been simulating like a, a lot, but I haven't flown a lot. I'm using, using enough rod here. Nice sky today, I tell you this. Nice sky for whale and butt. They're maneuverable, those birds. They're doing them. <laughs> they turn tight. They probably turn as tight as I can. battery on this plane. I had about six or seven of them when I made it. I only have five now. But, uh, kind of made it for the batteries because I had nothing to really do with them. Too small to go in the Vision Air. They're really for the uh, Mustang when we had the P-51 Mustang around. Me and my brother. So I made this light plane to deal with them. And it lasts a long friggin' time, this battery. This plane, I kind of hear it dying out a little bit now. I'm a full throttle man, though. Usually fly around full throttle. Anyway, this thing probably stalls. I mean, I got a half, not really, 
But that's how you wreck a play, more or less. If you if it's not a 3D play, you fucking fly it so slow. Wreck it. Motion, man. It's a motion. Well, that's battery, so I'm gonna keep my height up there. Off the throttle now. A little bit of throttle now. A little bit of throttle. Bring her in nice. Hope you guys got that. My head was up in the air like sometimes when I lay my chin's up in the air, my mouth open like Ooh, a moron. But came in nice again. It lands real nice, so that's it. It's easy to make play, man. Piece of foam board over there. Line, fold it over. Get the arm and wing on experimental airlines. You can see right there, I got one piece, I guess one big piece of foam in there, and then another little piece to make the airfoil. Glue it on a fuselage. I'm just gonna up my, my landing gear there. Just, uh, I think this is the landing gear from an S-Bock, Hobby King S-Bock, and I somehow I fixed big P47 wheels on it. But just put a piece of cable tie around after I glued it in. I notched it properly. The wood on top, so we can't crush the foam right there. Yeah, fucking, it flies great. So far, not even a nick on it. There's probably water on it today. But not a nick, man. Cause it lands so easily. That's awesome. So that's my homemade little stick plane. I wanted to make something so I can save things like this. Super Sport Rider out.